good morning, good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Guess what? It is Sunday morning. <coughs> yeah, what are you doing over there? Huh? You want to go for breakfast? Yeah. Yeah? All right. Where do you want to go? I don't know. What about over there? I think that's okay. Yeah? Yeah. I think that would right. be good. All right. Let's go over there and have some breakfast. You guys know where we're going? <laughs> The very well-known master steak. That's where we're going. It's always right there. <laughs> yes, and they do serve breakfast as well. So we're gonna go in there and have some breakfast. Since the husky is closed now, they have a restaurant in there too, and they got decent breakfast too. But uh, they uh, they are closed on the weekend nowadays because they don't get much business. So we got a little step down here. So. But yeah, they are closed on the weekend, so yeah, we got no other choice than to go here, I suppose, eh? Nope. No, eh? Anyways, we'll go inside and have some good breakfast. All right, guys. I told you we were going to Master Steak. Well, did you think we didn't have eggs for breakfast over here? Well, think again. They got a breakfast uh, steak here as well. Yes, indeed. So we're going to have us a good breakfast. We have had our breakfast and all that good stuff, right? Oh, yeah. Yeah. So now I went on this phone app here. I'm hoping you're going to be able to see that. It's not shining too much. And I went on this Uber uh, app that I have on here and I requested Uber to come and pick us up. So you can kind of see there on the map. That's where he's at. He's trying to get to us. But Dixie Road is closed right here at Charleston and Dixie. So you can't really uh, come to us that way. So he's got to take that route around us there. So, so yeah, so it says he should be here in about five minutes. So we're gonna wait to see if he's gonna show up and then we're gonna go to the uh, Square One Shopping Center. That's the plan anyway. So uh, let's get ready and then uh, we're ready for him when he shows up. Hey, there goes our Uber car. That's the white one there that uh, took us over here. And here we are, look at that. There's some big buildings over there, and we are over here at the uh, shopping center, eh? What do you say? Go inside and do some shopping? Yeah. Yeah? There you go. Hey, guys, here we are. Look at this beautiful uh, screen that they got up here, eh? Wow. That is awesome. Yeah, we're going to try and show you all kinds of goodies in here, eh? Look at that. Is that James Bond? I have no idea. Looks like him, eh? 007. That's what it looks like, but we're going to go for a good walk in here, eh? I know it might be a little noisy in here, but let's take a look what we got up here. Yeah, we got all kinds of goodies up here, eh? What do you think so far? It's cool. Yeah, all kinds of cool stuff down here, eh? Yes, indeed. It looks gorgeous down here. They got so many stores in here. It's almost uh, confusing, eh? <laughs> you can get lost in here. All right, guys, here we are. Still walking around and enjoying the beautiful views that they got up here. Yes, indeed. Look at that. It is a huge, huge place, eh? It definitely is. Look at that ceiling, how tall it is. Yeah. I'm going to go take a walk around over here and see what they got in there. I don't know what they got in there, but looks like they're building something new in there. But anyways, we're having a good time here. We already got the wife something here. We're not gonna tell you guys what it is, as of right now anyways. But anyways, we'll go continue shopping. Hey guys, we are done shopping at the uh, square one. And the Uber is taking us to uh, Cientar. We're just going right by the uh, airport here. So I figured, you know what? Let's turn it on a little bit. I asked him if it was okay. He said, yeah, no problem. I've never been down this road because no trucks are allowed to go down. Oh yeah, look at that guys. There's an airplane coming down guys. Look at that, he's coming right over us. Cool. <laughs> How sweet is that? You don't get that very often on my channel at least. <laughs> but anyways, we're on our way to the CN Tower. So we'll show you some more goodies over there. We're coming in towards downtown Toronto guys. Look at that CN Tower up there already. Look at that, how tall it is, eh? Wow, that, that's gonna be amazing going up there, eh? I think that's gonna be a fantastic experience for us. Look at all these high-rising buildings that they got up here. Really old buildings here to the right, but beautiful downtown Toronto. That's what they always say, right? <laughs> yeah, I think we're gonna go up to that second bowl again like I did last time and get a good view of Toronto. 
I think later on in the day it's supposed to be a little bit more sunny and we'll see uh, we'll see what we can see from up there hey guys look at that we are very very close to it here is the uh, Rogers Center coming up here to the left is our football stadium as they say right <laughs> or whatever it is I have no idea game center out at least but yeah look at that they got some kind of game going on here that's what I've been hearing looks like there's gonna to be tons and tons of people up here but we are just around the corner from stepping out to go to the uh, CN Tower yes indeed look at that how tall it is guys it is gonna be a good experience I think we're gonna try and see if we can uh, walk on the edge of that tower that's going to be an experience if they allow us to do that. You guys are going to come with us and watch it. <laughs> Here we are. This is our uh, Uber that we were with. But look it up. Look way up there. And that's where we're going to be at. Look at the city bus we got over here. Yes, indeed. This is going to be interesting, I think. What do you guys think? What about you? You think it's going to be interesting? Oh, very. Very interesting, eh? Alrighty, guys. What I haven't shown you is there's some really old classic trains over here as well yes indeed i remember taking a photo of that maybe some of you guys remember i taken the picture at night and uh we put it as a uh a screen on our facebook page back in the old days i think i, I have had it on there a few times as well but yeah this is downtown toronto ladies and gentlemen what do you say boy we go up there oh yeah let's go all right guys we are standing in line over here waiting to get our uh, tickets yeah, this is the surprise that we were telling you guys earlier that we're going to be doing. Just look at that. We got a bit of a lineup over here. Now we got to wait to get our tickets out, right? Alrighty, guys. It's time to go in and see the tower. Yes, indeed it is. Let's go in. We got our VIP tickets. Yeah. Let's go see where we can go into it. See these VIP tickets? Premium. Premium. Yeah. Let's go see where we can find them. Look at this, guys. Look at the screen that they got here to the side that looks like 3d ish eh? it sure does look 3d ish <laughs> trippy yeah yeah we can actually go up on the right lane here and the other other people has got to go on that side yes indeed. Right, guys here we are we are going up look at that guys we are going up super 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 fast yes indeed it is high definitely you see that how fast we are going up there <laughs> You can see through there in the bottom, eh? Look at that, where we're standing on. <laughs> That's the railway station over there, it looks like. But yeah, that is very, very fast. <laughs> I think that goes up like 21 kilometers an hour. There's the Delta. <laughs> yeah, wow, look at that. Over there you can start seeing the lake up there. Absolutely gorgeous. That is for sure. Wow. <laughs> that would be a long fall down, eh? <laughs> Look at that. That is very... Now it's starting to slow down, okay, so eh? So we will be making three stops. The first stop is on the glass floor for the premier ticket holders. So everybody else just remain in the elevator. We're at the top of the CN Tower. And you can see the Blue Jays game down there. Yeah. And we're trying to go live on Facebook. For some reason it's not working properly. Let's try this again. See if we can uh, get people to come in here this time. Before the internet didn't work. I don't know why, but for some odd reason it's not working. Look at all those boats down there. Yeah. And the airport's right there. Yeah. We got one person. Hopefully you can see it. Yeah. But, uh, she said that this was 147 uh, meters. No, yeah. no, uh, meters. No, uh, stories. Oh, 147 stories. Yeah, 147 yeah. stories. And, and uh, 470 some meters, eh? Yeah, it's 470 something meters. Yeah. And so. Over a thousand feet. Yeah, over a thousand feet. There's actually ships in the water up there. Yeah. Yeah. Look at all those cars. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And like from down down there at the ground, these 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 towers look pretty tall, but when you get up here, they're like really small. So it's sort of foggy, but 
If we're having trouble getting live due to internet, I should probably take this off. Yeah, so for those people who have watched the live and it's not working, we can't really do anything because we're just so high and so many people are over here, it's, the internet isn't really working. So. Uh, we, we did once a live at the bottom and we, uh, we were planning to start the live on the elevator while we were going up, but I think we'll try doing it going down. It's really cool. So. Alright guys, you can see the big lake up there. Let's take a look. <laughs> you can see the airport down there. Yeah. You see the big highway down there? Yeah. There's a big highway down there. There's even a train. You see the train down there? Yeah. Big water down there. Yeah. You see that? We got the Blue uh, Jays games going on down there. I hope you guys can see that. I don't know how much of it you're going to be able to see, but supposedly there's a Blue Jays game going on. You can look straight down here and you see the people walking down there. I don't know if the camera is going to be picking it up, but that is very, very, very tall up here. That is absolutely gorgeous, eh? Yeah, this is where we are at. Alrighty guys, we're going to show you some information about the tower. Yes indeed, look at that. They got all the details over here. And this is where you can actually climb on the edge of the tower. And this is the tallest point of the tower. 553 meters, 1815 feet tall. This is where we are right now. At 447 meters tall, 1465 feet. That's where we are right now. We're going to go down to this point later on which they got looks like they got a couple of levels up here one is 365 meters 1168 feet high now that is pretty tall eh? look at these thick walls that they got up here i'm hoping the camera is not going to be blinded too much by the uh by the uh, sun and all that or the, the the light you know but yeah that's a very very tall tower that is for sure hey guys look at that they got a leveling pin over here it shows you how much this tower is actually moving yeah really nice hey i know it's going to be quite noisy out here so we might have to speak up a little bit but we're going to give you a full tour of this now let's go around all the way let's go give you guys a full show oh that's nice nice cool air right there i guess comes right out of there yeah because it's, quite too hot high. over here <laughs> too high too high. yeah it's very hot over here but that's where they got the football stadium over there a big highway over there i know the camera probably doesn't show it very well but we're going to slowly walk around here a little bit and give you guys a little bit of a show hopefully it will be visible they got the big ontario lake over there there's a lot a lot of ships over there the big highway over there yes indeed but we are going to give you guys a little bit of a spiel from how this looks up up here you see that down there they got them umbrellas down there sitting there by the beach I mean it's a cement pad down there you see that right there yeah them yellow yellow beads up there all the boats down there and everything yeah I know hopefully you guys don't mind too much there's a lot of people up here as you guys can see tons and tons of people down here but yeah let's go walk on this other side and let's show you yeah look at the high-rise buildings up there yeah that's beautiful beautiful view from up here that is a fact look at that guys and we're on the uh, tallest part of this tower what we're going to do is we're going to go down to this uh, second level of this tower here pretty soon and then you can actually see some other stuff up there so let's go down there and we'll show you something down there all right guys we're going to show you something super scary we are standing on glass right now about 1400 and some feet high let's take a look guys <laughs> That is super cool, eh? Yeah. That's what I figured too. Lots of people on here, but that is going down over 1,400 feet. Almost looks like that's going down on an angle, eh? Yeah. 
Yeah, it certainly does look like it. Alrighty guys, we are here at the uh, second level now. Yeah, it's a bit difficult to show you guys too much because of the screen as you can see. But there is actually an airport right over there. If you guys can actually see it, I doubt it if you're going to be able to see too much up here. But we're going to show you around anyways. So let's go for a little walk. Yeah. Let's go ahead and show you guys a little bit. What we are looking at over here. There's a lot more room up here and a lot less people up here. Although it is a little windy up here. But yeah, you see the whole lake up there. Yep, just absolutely gorgeous, eh? What do you say, Diego? Has it been worth the uh, trip up here? Oh yeah. Yeah? Definitely worth it, eh? But I think we're gonna go down the uh, zone pretty soon, eh? Yeah. I think so too. I think we've seen just about everything up here, eh? Yeah. We tried to do a Facebook Live show, but that didn't seem to work. But anyways, we'll get out of here and then uh, we'll show you whatever we see downstairs yet. All right, guys, we got something cool coming up here. So let's take a look. Yeah, look at this, guys. Fun for the kids. <laughs> Look at that, guys. Yeah! <laughs> I think everybody enjoys this ride, eh? He got the captain in the bag, eh? Oh, yeah. All right, guys, we got some museum type of tra uh, trains down here. Yeah, look at that. They even got a rail in there. I guess they could actually move that if they really wanted to, eh? That could actually spin in here. Yeah, it's some kind of museum down here, but not exactly sure what it is they got more trains down there I think we're going to uh, go down there and have a look all right guys let's take a look at this train down here yeah let's go in here let's look at this <laughs> they even got a wheel down here eh? let's look see what this looks like in the old days how they slept look at that we got a gas oh that's supposed to be working but I guess it's not yeah wow look at this we got all kinds of books in here pictures yeah what do we got in there and how they used to work in here probably some construction it looks like yeah anyways they got a stove in here an old wood stove that's right that's how they used to keep warm in here i bet yeah what do we got in there you can go up there really no kidding what are we doing up here a uh, seating area that's pretty cool i would say so let's go to the next one let's see what we got in the next one here wow let's go walk through here Let's look inside here, what we got in here. What do we got in here, a show? TV, TV show? I guess you can watch a TV show here every once in a while. I guess you just have to wait for it to blow. I guess so, yeah. Anyways, I'm just gonna keep on walking. What about you, Diego? You coming? You coming too? Yeah? Let's go, let's show you fun. Huh? What do we got there? Free flyers? Probably. Anyways, let's get out of this way. Yeah, here we go. Let's get out of this train. It's hot in there. Definitely is hot in there. Hey, Captain. Hey, Captain. Hey, Captain. Yeah. What are you doing, Captain? Not sure. You're not sure? Where are you going, Captain? <laughs> he's not sure where he's going. All right, guys, if you want to see something real old, it says, please do not touch yeah wow that's an old engine eh what's that oh, what's that knobs and all the control panels and all that probably. wow that is cool eh that's probably a really old engine how they used to do it back in the day eh? hey look at that control panel up there yeah you want to tell us what it is uh sure it's yeah? a truck switch so basically, um, the black ones are the tracks, the red ones are the lights, and the yellow ones are interchangeable tracks. Wow. Could you tell us on what year they used to use this kind of system? Early 1900s. The early 1900s, wow. And Cabin D itself, this building is from 1890. 1890? Yeah. Wow. That is old. 
What you got in the corner over there? Uh, those are just lights. Oh, those are the old lights, hey? Wow. You mind if we take a look at them? Yeah, of course. Just All make right. sure. Uh, no touching, yeah. Of course, yeah. Yeah, you don't want that to go bad, eh? Look at that, guys. These are the old type of lights. Yeah, it's the... Mm-hmm. They got them in these wooden crates. Wow. Maybe JP would remember these back in the day. Yeah, so these were the switches they were telling us. Those are big switches. Well, guys, let's take a look what we got down here. What do you think it is there, boy? Uh, some type of engine. Some type of engine? What do you guys think? What kind of an engine is it? Can anybody tell us what kind of an engine it is? Nobody knows? It looks like a four-cylinder, eh? Doesn't it? Yeah, it is a four-cylinder. It is a four-cylinder, eh? One, yeah. One, two, three, four, no, five. It's a five? Well, that's a weird combination. Yeah. Yeah, no, actually it's a six, eh? Well, no? I, uh, one, two. No? no one, yeah, it is one, a six. Two, three, see? Uh, it's a six-cylinder. Well, well, this could be a cylinder. No, there's, there's, see the one there at the end? There's three of them that are really close together. Yeah. And then these ones are a bit further apart. You see that? You see that? Now those are that's a six cylinder. That's a big engine, eh? Wow. Who do we have up here, ladies and gentlemen? Edward S. Ted Rogers. Edward S. Ted Rogers. Yeah. yeah, let's take a look at him. He's got a bird sitting on, on his head. Yeah, he's shitting on his head. <laughs> he's shitting on his head. He's looking. He's going to shit you on your head, too. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get off of there, Dio. <laughs> yeah, look at that. <laughs> CN Tower right above us there. Yeah, isn't that cool? Yeah, we're gonna go walk around the Rogers Tower up here and see what all we can find up here, eh? Right. Something really cool I just discovered is up there. You guys see that? <laughs> it's in front of this home of the Toronto Blue Jays Stadium, right there. Right over there you can see the CN Tower. Yeah. We're getting ready to go back home to our truck. Yes indeed. We are back in the truck and we have been for a good while. And what do you think? Did we have a fantastic day or what? Very good day did we have today. Yeah, that's what I figured. Yeah, lots of fun at the CN Tower today. Yep, that was the most fun. There you go. I know this is probably a bit of a lengthy video or whatever, but uh, we did have us a blast over there and had a lot of fun. We sure enjoyed ourselves. Now, I got a question to ask or something to ask you guys if you guys are interested in doing this. Don't know exactly if you guys are going to be interested in doing this or not, but uh, we're going to ask it anyways. And that is, uh, I just have uh, recently hit my two year anniversary of my YouTube channel. I mean, I've had this YouTube channel maybe a little bit longer, but uh, since I decided to create videos, it's been about two years now. Uh, here in the middle of July it uh, turned into be two years and so I've been thinking you know what better way to give back to you guys as uh, to uh, I was thinking of, of this idea and that is uh, I'm gonna ask you guys to send me some video clips uh, you know maybe uh, you can record whatever you want basically just uh, letting me know uh, how much you appreciated my channel if i have been help to you if my channel sucks or whatever and uh what part you would like to see improve or whatever and put that on the video and what we're going to do is uh we're going to throw those video clips together and we'll throw that on to youtube for all of my viewers to see so if you want to be on my video send me some uh some clips and I will be happy to put that on to a special video as a uh, two-year anniversary uh, celebration video yeah I think that would be a good idea you know you guys can send me a little video and 
you know, tell everybody on how much you have enjoyed uh, this channel and stuff like that and who you are. Maybe tell everybody the name, who you are, and uh, tell everybody on uh, what this channel has meant to you. So I would appreciate that if you send that to me. And you can do that in the description below. There is an email address in there. You can try and do it there. If you can't do it there, you can try and do Messenger, uh, stuff like that. That's about the only two ways that you can really, I guess, do it. But uh, I know sometimes it's a little hard. Or uh, if you still can't do it, you could text me and or send me a message and. Uh, Maybe you can figure out a different way, but uh, yeah. And that would be uh, very much appreciated. And I wanna put that video into a, as a celebration video of, of my channel in two years. And as a thank you for you guys uh, being subscribed to me and uh, been watching me all this time, you know? So uh, yeah, I think that's about all for us today. We're going to go to bed here very soon, so uh, appreciate you guys sticking around. We'll catch you on the next one. This is Truck of Rudy signing off. It's time to get going. It's time to move on. Put this behind me. That day is going to come.